hey guys welcome back to the channel and if you're new to this channel you're absolutely welcome i hope you guys are doing great yeah so guess where we're traveling to today yeah you guessed right okay then so we're taking a trip to the namdi yazikiwe international airport and we are using the free train at the abuja metro station <laughs> This trip has been long overdue. It's been in my bucket list for a while now and I am finally fulfilling it. I'm so happy, so excited. Finally glad to take it off my bucket list. Who is as excited as I am? I hear this metro belongs to the FCTA, which is the Federal Capital Territory Administration. So let's begin the journey now, shall we? So we have the blue line and the yellow line. I'll explain this further in the video. So we'll be starting from the CBD, which is also known as Constitution Avenue. We head straight down and then turn right and we're at the metro. A lot of commuters benefit from this service. These people just alighted from the train as you can see from this footage. This metro is a blessing to the residents of the capital city. And it's also, it's also beneficial to travelers and visitors on vacation. I see a lot of effort being put into the maintenance of this metro. So this is the schedule for the free ride. Upon getting to the train, my heart was so warm. I was greeted by a pleasantly looking train. The color, the design, the ambience, everything was a 10 over 10 for me. The metro was very demure, very intentional and very satisfying. I hear it takes about 40 minutes to arrive at the airport from the metro. So let's see how that goes. At this point, it was exactly 10 a.m. and the trip began. I noticed that they do not do the Nigerian slash African time thingy we all know. The light trail is always on schedule and if you miss your scheduled time, that's all for you. Let me even confess to you guys, I actually missed my first trip for 8 a.m. Their 8 is 8 around here and their 10 is 10. If you snooze, you lose. The views from this train was thrilling and satisfying to behold. I wish I could just view this all day, honestly. I also wanted to get the most beautiful views for you guys. Trust me, I delivered on that. Yes or no? I know it's a big yes. So you would know that great things are happening back home.
I just love how organized things are over here. The free ride goes from Mondays to Fridays. The first train leaves at 8. Second leaves at 10. The third leaves at 3.30. And the fourth and the last one leaves at 5.30. So, I think we're approaching the next stop, which is Kukwabatu. So, the blue line and the yellow line, this is a phase one, and it costs the FCTA the sum of $823 million to construct this. So, hopefully, the remaining lines will be put in place and we'll have more lines going forward. Okay now, so let's talk about Idu um, train station. So the Idu station is a major interchange station. This is where the yellow line and the blue line meets. So what does this mean? This means that passengers going to Kaduna, passengers going to Kubwa can stop at this point and connect to their final destinations from here. So remember I told you I was going to explain about the yellow line and the blue line. So the yellow line and the blue line meet at this point. The yellow line runs from the CBD which is the central business district where you saw the World Trade Center. So the yellow line is the one that runs from the CBD to the airport. While the blue line runs from Idu to Kubwa. So we're just at um, Idu station right now. This free ride has been on since May of 2024. The President and Commander-in-Chief, President Bola Ahmad Tinubu, extended the ride until the end of December 2024. At this point, since we just passed um, Basanjiwa, which is the last station before we get to the airport station, we are gradually heading to the airport and we'll be there in no time. Can you see the lovely landscape, the clouds, the lovely greens and all the amazing things you see on your screen right now? Yeah, Nigeria is so beautiful. Yeah, we are good like that. And we are so beautiful like that. Okay. announcing our arrival at the airport so we have just landed the airport guys and i feel like this would this was way faster and easier than going by the road okay another thing i think you should know about the metro is that it is disability friendly there are ramps for wheelchair users and all so you can easily assess this um, metro without any hazards at all this is the first light rail system being developed in western africa and the second such system in sub-saharan africa after the addis ababa light rail I hear the FCTA has plans to construct the country's first underground rail line that will connect the Abuja metro station with the central business district and other parts of Abuja city. If this happens, this will be so, so good. It will be so great. It will be so amazing, guys. This would be 
a prayer answered honestly we are really hopeful that this happens soon so we can also bring you videos about it we currently have two lines which is the blue line and the yellow line when completed it will become six lines I am so proud of the FCT administration for bringing this to reality. It's a spectacular accomplishment. The light rail system features state-of-the-art infrastructure, including well-designed stations, modern trains, and advanced signaling systems. The trains are equipped with comfortable seating, air conditioning, and real-time information displays to enhance the passenger experience. The Abuja Light Rail offers an affordable alternative to road transport, with competitive ticket prices by the time they start pricing it is designed to make it accessible to a wide range of commuters. Just like you saw from the beginning of the video, a lot of commuters currently use it. Right now, it is free, but I know with time after December, as I said in my video, they would start paying. But even when they start paying, it would be affordable because that is like the easiest means for them. That is what the government intends to do with this. So it's going to be accessible and it's going to be affordable, making it an efficient choice for daily transportation. I am sure you were super proud of your home country at this point. We are making progress, we are getting there, and I know we will get there. Let's be hopeful, let's keep thriving, and I assure you, we will get there, okay? The Exim Bank of China provided 60% of the funds used for the construction of the light rail in Abuja. So the complete network is planned to link Abuja with satellite towns such as Nyanya, Kubwa, Maraba and Lube. The light rail network developed under the first phase has a total length of 45.2 kilometers. Lot 1, also known as the blue line, has a length of 17.89 kilometers. On the other hand, the yellow line has a total of 27.2 kilometers. The two lines include 12 stations, 13 bridges, 21 operational offices, 9 pedestrian overpasses and 50 culverts. The light rail Abuja system is mainly intended to reduce the traffic congestion and offer an enhanced travel experience to the commuters in the federal capital territory i told you guys earlier this channel is for travelers is for those on vacations is for people who want to commute from one point to the other easily especially from the airport to the city center this is one of the reasons why this was created and it's going to be very beneficial to you if you're coming in and you easily want to move into town without getting into the hassles of the traffic usually around the airport access.
This demonstrates the commitment of the Nigerian government at improving urban transportation for its citizens. So we just arrived the CBD, we just arrived the Abuja metro station and this is the exit point. If you followed me and watched this video up until this point, I am super grateful to you. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for liking it. Thank you so much for subscribing to this channel. I am super grateful, okay? Now, I would leave you to keep watching this video just to, um, you know, when you watch some movies and after the movie ends, you get some clips, you know, by the side just to give you some other things that would have come up in the video but didn't come up. So that's what this one is right now. There are just some things that didn't appear in the video, right? Okay, so just enjoy it, all right? So bye, see you in the next video. Bye, 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 bye. So this place is um the construction. This is where the trains are being constructed. I mentioned that in the video. So yeah.